Hey guys, NanoZombie here, and today I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how to both set up, turn off, and turn back on Cortana on Windows 10. So, to start off, when we're setting it up, you, you have a brand new computer and you see Cortana right here. So you click on it, and it will say, Welcome back. Let's pick off where we left off. Even though you haven't done anything with it yet, it still asks, still says that. But now, before we get started, as it's a brand new computer, it says you'll need to sign in with a Microsoft account. So let's do that. Now, once you've logged in, it will then come up with its base page. As I live in Seattle right now, and I have my location turned on, it shows Seattle and all the different things like sports teams, popular news, top news, and just general things that it might interest you. Now let's move on to turning Cortana off. So if we want to turn Cortana off, we go into this little icon, it's called the notebook. Then you go into the settings, and you there's the first thing, it says Cortana can give you suggestions, ideas, reminders, alerts, and more. You want to turn this off. Now turning this off will then set Cortana to, to not be on, which will then change this from ask Cortana anything to search the web in Windows. Now once you click on it, it will come up with these six boxes. These six boxes are the standard things Windows use to search for things, to locate things. So this is useful if you just want Cortana or like need to save RAM, upgrade on an older computer. Though, to do to turn it back on, you basically just do the same thing. But in this case, it's no longer the notebook. It's now the settings little icon. Now you go to this, and you turn Cortana back on. And then she says, welcome back. Let's pick it off. Pick up where we left off. And then we see, before we get started, this is basically their privacy statement for Microsoft and basically what Cortana can do. You then say use Cortana, and now she's back on saying ask me anything and shows your stuff back again. I hope this was a helpful tutorial. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you all in the next video.